Dozens of migrants post lined up in front of the press at a detention center in Libya. With these images recorded last May, the Libyan government was trying to deny that torture and rape of migrants were taking place in the country with impunity, as denounced by several NGOs. But the situation does not seem to have changed since then, nor have the allegations of mistreatment of migrants in detention centers. Now my foot is sadly injured because I had to swim from a Zawiya board. Because I couldn't, uh, you know, be seen from the Libyan Coast Guard. Yeah. The Libyan militias, those criminals, they saw us, they will apprehend us. They will apprehend us and may uh, kill us. Because the last year, I've seen people got killed from the Libyan Coast Guard. Maybe eight or seven people uh, from African nationalities. They were killed. Although their numbers have been reduced this year, the flow of refugees continues to arrive on European shores. Despite recurrent but hardly verifiable complaints from migrants, the European Union seems to turn a deaf ear and continues to cooperate with Tripoli. In early August, Human Rights Watch, HRW, accused the European border agency Frontex of supporting Libyan forces with drones to intercept migrant boots. European money, they say, funds torture in Libya.